Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming to you with my holiday essentials and I'm going to get started with some fragrances since that is kind of the first thing I do as I'm getting ready to go out for either a holiday event or to spend time with family and friends over Christmas, New Year's, all of the parties that um, I attend during the holiday season. So I'm gonna start again with fragrance and I think that's sort of like the first thing that sets the tone for feeling kind of uh, special in the evenings going out or even in the daytime going out. The first fragrance um, that is not gonna come as a surprise because it's one that I wear year round and it is my signature scent. It is my Chanel number no. five and this is the Low. And I absolutely love this fragrance. I think it's perfect for the holiday season and just about any time. But um, for me, Chanel Number no. 5 holds a special place in my heart since it was the fragrance I wore on my wedding day as well as um, to many other important sort of occasions in my life. And I think of it as such a special sort of fragrance in general. Um, I think all Chanel fragrances are beautiful and perfect for holiday times or holiday season. So definitely number five um, is one of the three fragrances I had to talk about as a holiday essential. And the next two fragrances I wanted to talk about are both by Tom Ford and are both pretty new to me. The first one is Tom Ford's Fucking fabulous. Um, I love this fragrance. I think it is a perfect kind of special going out in the evening scent. It is kind of deep and mysterious, um, but perfect for getting all dressed up and wanting something that feels like the little black dress of fragrances. So really loving this. And the second Tom Ford fragrance that I'm absolutely in love with, this is the newest fragrance in my collection and it is Tobacco Vanille or Vanille. Love this fragrance. This is a dark smoky fragrance that smells exactly like the name would imply, like tobacco and vanilla. It is um, soft and sweet, but yet at the same time a little bit powdery and very smoky and just kind of perfect, I think, for the holidays. Something about this makes me think of just getting all bundled up and going out when it's chilly and, um, and having a warm glass of anything wherever you're going. So absolutely perfect scent for the holiday season. The next holiday essentials I wanted to talk about are all beauty related. I'm gonna start with skin. I think um, it is most important to take care of your skin in the winter time in general, but um, during the holidays, I always wanna just look like I have that lit from within glow about me. And one of the products I have been absolutely loving that I could not be without this holiday season is Bobbi Brown's Extra Illuminating Moisture Balm. And this is a product that I use in place of my moisturizer or actually over my moisturizer. And I'm just putting a little on my hand and hopefully you can kind of see that it gives your skin just this beautiful luminosity. Um, it's also a moisturizer, so you are moisturizing your skin and it just gives it a little bit of a glow, a little something extra that makes your skin look even more refreshed and beautiful during the holiday season. So could not be without this product. And then a few makeup products from Bobbi Brown that I absolutely love during the holiday season. The first one I just talked about in my favorites video for November. This is the Nude Finish Illuminating Powder. And here is what that looks like. This is a powder that I'm wearing today. It just gives your skin a little bit of luminosity instead of having sort of a matte, flat look to your skin when you are sort of finishing your makeup. So really love this product. And then for a little bit of a highlight, um, I have a Bobbi Brown highlighting powder. This is the Brightening Brick in Naked, and it looks like this. And this has even more um, of a highlighting quality to it, and so I would use this just on the high points of my cheeks, top of my cheekbones, around uh, my brow bone, and maybe a little down my nose and on my cupid's bow. So really love this stuff, and I love the packaging of this. It's absolutely beautiful to take out with you when you're out and about for the holidays. And the last um, Bobbi Brown product that I've been wearing for years and absolutely love during the holidays is the Shimmer Brick. The one that I have pulled out here is in the Rose Quartz. And I think this is a beautiful, beautiful Shimmer Brick for the holidays. It just has kind of a, um, kind of a rose gold effect to it. And I love using this both as a highlighter and um, it's almost like a cross between a highlighter and a blush because there is a little bit of pink color to this and I use it also as an eyeshadow. So this is just a really great multitasking product and great to have for the holidays. And the last of my beauty essentials for the holidays would have to be the red lip and I have so many different reds that I love so I thought I would show you some of my favorites including the one that I'm wearing right now. This is the newest lipstick in my collection. It is from Chanel. This is the Rouge Allure 
velvet, I believe it's called. The packaging on this is beautiful. To, put, to get it out, you just press on the top and pull it out like so. There's a little number five engraved in there, if you can see that. And the formula on this is just a beautiful matte velvety formula. It is definitely more moisturizing than a lot of matte lipsticks I've used. And it is a perfect true red for anyone who's looking for the perfect red lip for the holiday season. The next three lipsticks I'm gonna talk about are all from Bobbi Brown. You all know I'm a huge Bobbi Brown fanatic. And uh, the first of these is from the Lux Matte Lip Color. And this is in the color Red Velvet, which is a deep true red and perfect for the holiday season if you're looking for something a little darker, very matte, and um, yeah, the packaging on this is also beautiful in this sort of matte gold, I'm trying to find the front, <laughs> in this matte gold. The next uh, lipstick, I picked up this one up last year for the holiday season. This is Bobbi Brown's Lux Lip Color in Parisian Red, and you can see, um, as opposed to the matte gold, this one is in the shiny gold, which indicates that this is just the regular Lux formula. This is also a beautiful color. And I think I said it before, but this is Parisian red and I absolutely love this. It is not quite as long wearing as the Lux matte formula and it can sort of get onto your teeth if you're someone who um, is looking for that not to happen. I definitely suggest going for a matte formula, but I love that color and um, it does have great staying power as well. And the last of my Bobbi Brown lipsticks, um, I showed this in a recent video. This is Starlet Scarlet, and um, it is from the matte, I'm gonna get this wrong, I think it's called the Matte Velvet, Lux Velvet, um, and this is a liquid lip color in another beautiful red. This one is a little bit more of a cool red, but still absolutely perfect for the holidays. The next holiday lipstick I wanna talk about is from Charlotte Tilbury, and this is from the Matte Collection. This is in Red Carpet Red, which is a beautiful red, and again, a very true red, a little bit blue-toned, but perfect for the holidays. And the last two lipsticks I have to talk about are from MAC. One of them is an oldie but goodie. This is MAC's Russian Red, one of my favorite reds of all time that, um, up until recently was probably my go-to lip for every holiday season for years and years. Um, but I have recently come across a color at MAC that I wasn't familiar with previously, but it is so beautiful. It is this really bright pop of red in the color Red Rock. So um, it's really hard to see the difference between the reds, but maybe if I hold them up together, you can kind of see this one is, um, Russian red, this one is red rock, and red rock just has this real brightness about it. It's not really a pinky red, it's not, I mean, it's a little more pinky, I guess, than orange, but it is just um, a beautiful red color and perfect for the holiday season. So my next holiday essential would have to be luxurious fabrics and luxurious clothing in general. I tend to get a little more dressy for the holidays and wear things that I don't wear in my normal day-to-day -day life. One of those things being velvet. I absolutely love velvet during the holidays. And last year I picked up this boyfriend style blazer from Express that I am absolutely psyched to wear again during this holiday season. This pair is absolutely beautiful. Again, over another more luxurious fabric like silk. So I will probably pair this over one of my silk camis. This one um, I picked up from Anina Bing. Another thing I love to wear during the holidays are sequins. I've got this old kind of black mini skirt that I whip out every year during the holidays. This is something that you can um, just wear with a blazer. You can wear it with just a long, beautiful cashmere sweater. There's so many different ways you can wear this and I definitely love wearing cashmere again over the holidays. It's such a luxurious fabric and um, love having a little bit of sparkle. And then this year I picked up a midi length skirt from Gap. Now this is like super sequins as you can see. This was such a great deal during uh, the Black Friday sale. It is lined, it has an elastic waistband and it is a really kind of thick, um, fabric because of the lining. So I think it will um, look beautiful with a nice pair of strappy heels, um, possibly um, some velvet shoes, something that just gives it again that little bit of luxury for the holidays. And another way of wearing velvet during the holiday season is on your feet. I love wearing velvet shoes and I picked up this really cute pair of velvet booties. I'll try to find the name of these below if they're still available, um, but they are just a really cute um, 
booty that you could throw on with a pair of jeans and dress it up with a nice cashmere sweater or anything with some sequins um, or luxurious fabrics. I think that is a good way of kind of dressing up but still being comfortable and that is what it's all about for me during the holiday seasons being sort of feeling luxurious but at the same time feeling comfortable which um, I think goes hand in hand. And then what would the holidays be without a little bit of sparkle? I have quite a few um, accessories or fashion jewelry that I like to wear during the holiday season. Um, I've got these beautiful uh, blingy little bracelets that I picked up from J. Crew over the years. Love wearing those during the holidays. I've got these beautiful little snowflake earrings that I received last year for Christmas. I think it was last year from my aunt. I absolutely love these for the holidays. And um, I've got a couple of brooches that, of course, I whip out a lot during the holidays. The first one being my Chanel um, CC brooch and the other being this vintage brooch that used to belong to my grandmother that is just reminds me of a snowflake as well. So these are really lovely and a nice way to kind of dress up your outfits during the holidays. And last but not least, the holidays are a perfect time to whip out all your most beautiful, luxurious handbags. I think any handbags you have that are kind of special to you or um, bags that you kind of reserve for going out in the evenings, I think this is a perfect time to whip them out. The first one for me would absolutely be my Chanel Classic Flap. This bag, I think, just dresses up any outfit, even with the silver hardware. I know I got the silver hardware because I thought it was a little more subtle and casual, but it looks absolutely stunning when you're dressed up as well, and I think this is a perfect handbag for the holidays. And my other favorite handbags for the holiday season would have to be my Chanel Walks. I love using both of these during the holidays. The red, of course, is just perfect because it goes with everything that I like to wear during the holiday season, and red is just so symbolic of Christmas, and it is just, you know, beautiful. Love using this as a handheld clutch as well during the holidays, and um, my original, my first uh, Chanel bag that I ever purchased is my Chanel Walk, and I love, love, love this. Again, just as a handheld clutch or something you're going to stick under your arm, it holds exactly what you need for going out in the evenings and nothing more <laughs> but um, these are both really really great bags I think for dressing up an outfit and um, adding a little bit of Chanel to your holiday look and that is it for my holiday essentials I hope you enjoyed this video I will leave a list of everything I talked about down below and if you have any questions feel free to leave them in the comments otherwise thank you all for watching and I hope you have a great holiday season and I'll see you soon in my next video bye